Unreal shows there's more to reality television than fantasy suites and endless rose ceremonies. Set on a dating show like The Bachelor, Unreal stars Shiri Appleby as an unhinged young producer struggling both to create and obliterate traditional fantasies of romance. This ingenious satire dives headlong into the big subjects, class, mental illness, workplace power dynamics, media exploitation, and delusional Cinderella-style romance. Unreal is a brilliant parody that takes no prisoners while never turning cynical. Okay, here we go. Opening night, everlasting, all right? Let's give them something that they want. Romance, love, I don't know. It's all a bunch of crap anyways. Let's go, people. Screw this! Repo Pam, we gotta run our people. Camera A, follow Brittany. You get cash bonuses for nudity, 911 calls, cat fights. She's charming. Well, what we need you to do is talk about being a virgin. Oh. This job, this job is Satan's ass. Here to accept the Peabody Award is Sarah Gertrude Shapiro. Yeah. Thank you. Hi. Wow. <laughs> um, Unreal is a show that was made uh, on giant, foolhardy leaps of faith by everyone involved in every direction, pretty much constantly. So for the show to be recognized tonight is a truly unexpected and game-changing honor for us. We really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And deepest thanks to the cast, especially to Sherry Appleby and Constance Zimmer, who's on an airplane right now. She's going to be here in like 10 minutes uh, for taking a chance on me and on the show and for being some of the finest, most fierce and visionary human beings that I know and have had the pleasure to work with. I also absolutely have to acknowledge the outstanding team of executive producers who've helped bring this uh, wild beast to birth. First and foremost, Marty Knoxon, Sally DeCipio, Stacey Rukeyser, Bob Sertner, Carol Barbie, and Peter O'Fallon, to name a few. And thank you to the ever lion-hearted Nancy Dubuque of A&E for taking an enormous chance on my very weird little short film <laughs> and fostering the creative freedom to make an even weirder show with two deeply flawed female anti-heroes made by some very special women, too, also us. Um, Rob Sherno, Barry Johnson, Nina Lederman, and everyone at Lifetime and a &E Studios for being honestly unreasonably wonderful to us and allowing us to try things that didn't make any sense at first and trusting that we had a plan, because we did. So thank you so much, truly, from all of us.